lumalabo na ba yung mata ko? Kasi may pag yung napanood ko yung Petron, parang dalawa yung nag-ano eh. Yung nag-handle nung team eh. Like head coach. Parang, parang, I know Olsen is the head coach. But I also know na Raiko has very big responsibilities in terms of, you know, crafting the plays and putting in the system, ganyan. So, my question is, um, in that kind of setup, uh, sino masusunod? Yeah, it should be the head coach. Exactly. Which is yes. So, Olsen. That's why I'm uh, asking. You know, uh, in, in our in our in our team, um, Coach Bong Ramos is our assistant coach, right? And during practice, excuse me. During practice, Coach Bong runs our drills, but in the end, Coach Junel overlooks everyone. And pag dating sa game, it's only Coach Junel who does the talking and the using the whiteboard and directing plays and subbing. Pero when I watched the Petron game, it seemed like. I think, I don't know, ikaw muna, tapos ako magsasabi, parang it's kind of weird and seeing two guys shouting at you and directing plays, I don't know who's gonna be following. Enlighten us. Uh, ah, yan! Yeah. Yeah. I don't know, I, I guess it will be up to the management who they designated. I mean, obviously, Olsen is the head coach, but if management will say, oh, let's follow what Coach Raiko wants, then I don't know, I really don't know what the arrangement is, but I'm sure... Is that ideal? Yun na lang, ganun na lang. Kasi kanya-kanya naman diskarte yan eh. Diba? Kanya-kanya diskarte on how you want to run the team eh. Well, for me, as long as both coaches are on the same page, what they preach, they're yes. consistent yeah. with what they want. I mean, sure. they've been having a system in their practices, uh, from the plays to the offense to their, all their rules. And, and as long as they're sticking to that, then I, I don't see the problem. Um, kanya-kanya diskarte, kada team, kada organization, may kanya-kanya uh, ways of doing things. I remember Powerade that eh. Coach Bo was the head coach, and then... Uh, Alex Compton was your offensive coach and Ricky Dandan was your defensive coach. I don't know But cheer. But coach. Sabi ni coach mo mga gilas players na diga scout. Like like uh, American football, you have your yes, defensive yes. coordinator, offensive coordinator, and nakita na rin natin yan kay coach Shot Tank and Senen coach Jong Wichiko dati. There would be nung si coach Jong pa yung head coach nun, barangay na bra. There would be certain situations where si coach Shot pag mga last second play, siya is krima, siya do drawing. Um, merong bagong PBA rule na dalawa na lang ang pwede tumayo sa bench. That's a joke. The head coach and the first assistant coach. Teams like itong uh, San Miguel Coffee Mixers, Coach Tim Cohn is the head coach, pero every game, iba-iba yung assistant coach niya. Kung yung, si Richard ang assigned for this game, Jeff Carriasa for that game, Johnny Abariantas yeah. for that game, yung mga assistant coach and ko, iba na, nag-take turns sila to be the lead assistant coach. Dito daw, according to a reliable source sa Petron, uh, consultant dapat si Coach Raiko Toroman Pero for him to be to be allowed by the PBA to stand during games Ang nakasulat ngayon daw uh, Olsen Rasela, head coach Raiko Toroman, consultant slash assistant coach Kaya pwede siyang tumayo Hindi siya natatawagan ng warning or technical Kaya dalawa yung uh, nagkukumpas uh, talaga doon Do you think it will work? Um, for a team like Petron who we looked at na looks like they were confused with their roles last season um they didn't really know what they were supposed to do paano ngayon malalaman nila yung roles nila kung hindi rin malaman kung sino pa papakinggan there were only one game into this uh asama kasi uh, for a lineup like that you don't expect any lineup to be blown like that to be blown away by 20 points so maybe a few more games we'll see if it actually works or not oh i think it will I honestly think it will work. Yeah. Maybe I'm, with, I'm a bit biased because of Coach Raiko, but also, you know, it's just one game. It's their first game. Yeah. Pa sila. Like Magu said, it's still a long season. And, you know, one player they're really who's going to change everything is Marshall. When he comes back, they're going to be a different team. And I really believe they'll still go places. I mean, I, I hope not because I want our team to go places. <laughs> but, you know... Uh, I think vacation, the, I think, vacation, I, vacation, I, yeah, vacation. Right. I think go places. I, <laughs> go places, I mean. I think they'll be fine, actually. So that setup, you think, is uh, while not necessarily ideal, it doesn't mean that it, it's not workable. And, yeah, uh, I think it will be workable. Now. Again, as long as they're on the same page. Because if two two coaches are preaching different things and two coaches are different want uh, want different like rotations or whatever, then it's not going But if they get on the same page and it works, they're going to be very dangerous. I think it's a natural consequence, you know, and, you know, with so many people saying that uh, Petron is the team to beat, and then they, they get blown out in the in the first uh, game. Natural lamang na, may papupunahin mo yung mga ibang bagay na nangyayari. And I guess, ang daling mapansin kasi na 
Olsen, and then Raiko, and then you know, parabang there's a little confusion as to sino. Kasi makikita ko pag timeout, si Coach Raiko yung yeah. nag-cockrockies dun sa whiteboard. Consistent ba every time? Huh? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. But honestly, you know, if I'm if I were part of the team, I guess the players, the coaches, they should they shouldn't mind what everybody says or even if it looks like oh this looks bad, see coach Ryan, you know, they should just focus on their game, which is the most important thing. Yeah, yun nga. And then once they start winning, eh, pati tayo, hindi natin papansin yun. And now, we'll, and then we'll say... Kung masasanay din yung mga players na gano'n. Yeah. Time will tell Okay, so it's only the first game. I think we need to stress that. One, one game pa lang naman yung Petron. Big test, however, on Sunday when they face uh, San Miguel Coffee. Mm-hmm. So, Petron? that's the... Para ko po muna. Don't say the boo. On Sunday, sinasabi ko lang sa akin. Ang ibig sabihin ni Miko. Ang Sunday, yung Ang ibig sabihin ni Kuya Miko. Hindi kayo big test. Hindi yung big test. Sinasabi ko lang. Don't overlook it. Big test, bigger test yung Sunday. Wala ka na syllable eh. Lifetime. Ay, lusot. Kasi masakit.